Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning back with another War Robots video today. We're checking out the Sharenga. This is the one on my personal account. I've also got a maxed out one on my Battle Rec account. And I will say this, they're both a little bit hard to keep alive. But we're going to talk about uh, building this guy up, which upgrades are the most important, um, how to play him in the battle, what weapons to put on them, all that good stuff. So this is my Sharenga guide, guys. All right, so first off, let's go talk about modules. All right, you're either going to want to run, my opinion is you're going to run either three antimatter reactors or three cannibal reactors. Um, you can mix those up if you want to. Cannibal reactors are better at taking out other titans. Antimatter is good for destroying everything. And on the bottom slot, you can either run another antimatter a cannibal you can run an armor kit you can run a anti-stealth you can run the speed module a healing kit pretty much anything you want fits on the bottom now i don't have enough modules up here to really max them out and fill it up the way i would like but personally i think i would either run four cannibal reactors or i would run you know two antimatters and two cannibals, or I would just do the three antimatters and a plated armor, kind of like this, all right? So that's how I would set up my modules on there. Weapons, I've done a lot of testing on the weapons, and vengeance, one vengeance and two groms, or three groms are amazing on this guy, all right? I like these setups a lot, but that's how I would set mine up on the weapons and the modules, basically. Now, one build I've been playing with on my Battle Rec account is the Cataclysms, all right? The Cataclysms are really cool. Those, are, those have a 600 meter range. You can really eat up the enemy from 600 meters with three of those on there. And I will say this, though, even the Shrenga on my Battle Rec account and the one on my personal account, they're both very hard to keep alive. They're squishy. They die easy. So you got to be really careful with these guys if you don't want them to die. But they will pack a huge punch. They'll usually do loads of damage before they get taken out. And they're very good titans overall. Alright, so we're going to get into some gameplay. I'm going to give you some tips and whatnot while playing this guy. And I'm going to pause it. And I'm going to unpause it once the Sharenga comes back out. So for now, we'll catch you later. And we'll see you in just about two seconds. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and bring this guy out. Right, we're gonna come into here. We gotta be really careful that we don't die. And you wanna watch when you use the red button. That's what I call his ability that turns the other player red and slows them down. All right, you gotta watch that your team's not ready to get a kill or something because sometimes you can hinder your team instead of help it by turning somebody red. All right, don't like someone's ready to get that last shot on a guy. Next thing you know, bam, you turn it red and then that guy wastes the last of his ammo or it actually happens all the time with players and then he doesn't get that kill and then the guy turns around and kills him because your teammate ends up running out of ammo or something so what we want to do is kind of use this guy from afar right until we can get up really close like at point blank this thing destroys people so you need to make sure you can hide until you can get close enough. We're going to red button that other Sharenga. And now he's out in the open really good. We're going to hit the double damage. Now hawks are your enemies, guys. I am being hawked, and that is not good. But we're going to kick this guy's butt before he kills us, right? Or at least we were until he hit us with the red button. So we're going to go ahead and red button that Arthur. And for some reason, it didn't work. I don't know who got hit. Someone else must have got hit with it. But uh, let's see if we can hit that Arthur. We cannot. Let's get that little guy. He came into a bad spot. Let's hit the double damage. For me, it's only 30% instead of double. But we'll bust this guy up. Here comes another Titan. All right, we're going to red button him. I'm in a bad spot. I'm in a bad spot. Let's go ahead and see if we can take him on. And I know I'm about to die, so I'm going to hit the double damage. I'm going to get back to cover. Hopefully, I can get a teammate to come over in here and heal me. Probably not, because I am about two seconds away from death. That's the one problem with this robot, is he dies so fast, but he packs a punch like crazy. 
We're gonna red button that guy while he's currently in his ability. There's someone over there. Let's see if we can take that Ming out real fast. Thank goodness we have a healer. Look at that shell. Watch. Wait a second. Why is he not taking damage there? I know your shield's not that good, sir. And come on. We're going to red button him to till his last stand ends. And now we're going to womp on him real quick. Womp. 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 He's done. All right, let's try and womp on this Arthur from back here. We're gonna hit the double damage again and we're just gonna go in for it i knew i was gonna die there but hey we did pretty good with that right we did pretty good with that overall all right so i'm gonna go ahead and drop this guy in and we're gonna try and make sure we stay in places nobody can hit us until we find just the right time to rush in now there's always a chance the enemies are gonna rush me and if they do they're probably gonna be in for a pretty unhappy surprise all right, but by am dead. Now we're gonna hit the double damage. That guy's got a shield. We don't want to shoot that leech yet, but we do want to smash this guy up, right? I'm gonna say later, dude. We're gonna red butt him while he's in his ability there. He had a little purple shield up, so we red button them until we can take him out, right? Let's get this guy. That guy's oh, he's got a last stand, unfortunately. I don't care if that's a leech. We're gonna take him out. All right, what you want to do is make sure you find a place where you can stay away from the enemies. I'm going to tell you, though, he's so squishy. Right now, we got a bunch of titans, so we don't dare go over there, or they will wreck us, all right? Let's get rid of the uh, ammo. Here comes somebody that we're going to be able to pound in just two seconds. We're going to hit the double damage right now. That dude is a dead dude. He doesn't stand a chance, right? We will see you later, buddy. Bop, 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 bop got him here comes an arthur unfortunately i'm locked down i want to be able to get back to safety right now because that will kill me i'm not close enough for my shotguns to really get him so i want to wait till he's more out in the open before i attack that guy so sharanga is all about knowing when to go in and when not to go in to keep him alive so we're gonna go ahead and move on over to all right, somebody's up in the air with stealth, and we're gonna go ahead and wait for it to land. I don't think I'm gonna get close enough. I can bop him a couple good ones. Bop this guy, oh, he's too far away. This might not be a good idea, but we're gonna go, nope. We're gonna get back to safety. Look how much health I'm losing, how fast. All right, we're gonna go ahead and use this. It's probably gonna kill me. Let's red button that guy until he gets closer. When he comes closer, we're going to step out of here and we're going to do major damage. He's going to kill me, but double damage, right? Watch this. We're going to smack him. Oh, we got we got killed. So Trenga is very hard to keep alive, but he's actually a lot of fun. Now, if you happen to have some uh, Nodens on your team and the Nodens can sit there and help heal you, you can keep your Trenga alive for a really long time. But that's where it comes in with the squad play where... You know, you got to be on a full squad with some other guys that are on board with them. All right, so we're going to go ahead and drop in here. We're just going to play a full game on this one. And I'll tell you, something's wrong with my shell. Watch how fast this thing dies. I feel like my shell is really messed up for some reason. Other people have these immortal shells that just won't die. Look, I'm already taking damage and my shield's not broken. I don't know if they have flaming weapons or what, but let's go after this dude. Let's, let's smash this little guy down, all right? We're going to just wreck him bad. All right, he can't do nothing. He's gone. He's gone for it. We're going to go ahead and go into our ability right now. We're going to try and blow up and explode on this guy. But ba bam Take that. Where's he at? He's, he's a little pursuer, man. These little turds, these little fast turds that you can't see are everywhere these days. My shell is doing okay this time, but uh, we got to beat up this Fenrir. We're going to go ahead and hit that healing module. We're going to go ahead and use that ability. And come on, ammo, ammo. There we blew up on him. He's going to destroy us, all right? So we're going to have to come in here with something else. I'm going to go ahead and bring in this dude. My shell didn't perform too bad that time. Normally it does a lot worse than that. So we don't want to lose this beacon here. All right, I'm going to come over here and help this guy take it. All right, he's got help. He doesn't need it. We're going to move somewhere else then. Those guys are good. All right, there's two of them over there. I don't think they're going to lose it. We just need to smash this dude, and we need to get this beacon back here. So let's do this. 
we're gonna land we're gonna hit him with the four wasps you know that hurts mr fenrir you know that hurts we're gonna go ahead and hit our oh he's got a shield so we're gonna get up inside of his shield we're gonna get up inside of there all right come on reload 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 so close come on come on there we go whoa don't waste that ammo perfect all right we're just gonna womp on this guy good we're gonna go up in the air now i got a purple shield for a couple oh they locked me down I can't target him because he's underneath me. This robot has a really hard time targeting people that are kind of under him, so let's go ahead and do this. Unfortunately, there's only two shots left on my wasps, so I'm going to have to land and let those recharge here in a second. We want to get rid of that guy as quickly as possible. We want to get rid of this guy. I'm going to hit that healing. Actually, my last stand was on, so that was a terrible time to hit that healing. Come on, we gotta make these red dudes some dead dudes. Where's he at? 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 Let's get him. All right, come on, come on. Let's run over this way. Um. Okay, we got... Uh, I don't know what's going on with our ammo here. So we're gonna drain all of our ammo and let it all reload. There we go. Now we're gonna have some fresh, full ammo in a second. I'm gonna go ahead and stomp on this guy. Whatever's over here, they're going down. There's a bunch of them. All right, we're going to mash these red dudes. We're going to make them dead dudes. All right, let's beat him up. We're going to fly over on here to the back. Thank you, drive through. Oh, yeah, let's land because I know this robot when you're too high in the air. Oh, crap sandwiches. That was a big old poopoo -poo doo doo thing right there. No, stop shooting me. Just let me have the beacon. Be nice and let me have it. Oh no, goodness gracious. There we go. Stomp on him. Stomp on him. Stomp on him. Ah, bust his face. Why are you shooting me, dude? That little blitz is like trying to get me. We're going to go up in the air now. We got this shield. Where is he at? There he is. Come on, get him, get him, get him. Okay, we're going to go ahead and land. And as soon as he comes out of that ability, we're going to womp on his face. Pop, 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 pop. Yeah. Da, 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 dead. All right, so now I got to wait 14 more seconds and then I can fly on out of here. All right, so we've got four beacons, but we're losing one. We got to get over there and get another one. Hey, there's Chunky Bot. I bet he plays a lot of uh, Fenrirs and <laughs> Lancelots. Mr. Chunk Chunk over there. We're going to go get Mr. Chunky Chunk. I think someone just killed him. Never mind. Oh, they got a Ming. They got a Ming. We're about to bring our Sharanga out in just a minute. All right, Sharanga is next on the list of robots to come out. We need to help our team get this beacon here. It looks like we're struggling over on this side. So let's womp on this guy. All right, let's try and get this dude. I'm going to hit my healing because I know I'm almost dead. Let's hit him with those other weapons. I am in a bad spot. So, uh, yeah, not wonderful. Not wonderful. All right, I know I'm going to die anyways, so whatever. Oh, Ming parts are flying through the air. All right, let's go ahead and bring our Sharanga in. Is that a good guy? Okay, that's our team. There we go. Let's double that damage and smash their Sharanga. He's got some sort of laser beams on his over there, so we're just going to womp on him real good. All right, he's dead. We got him. Smashed and bashed. Here comes another enemy. We're going to red button that guy for a second. We're going to hit that double damage, and now we're going to womp on his face. Yeah, how you like that, little dude? Red dudes be dead dudes. Yeah, here we go. So right now, we got to be really careful of that Ming. He's to the, he's to the point where he's too far away for me to hit. Uh-oh. We're going to use the double damage, and as soon as he lands, you're done for, dude. That was a bad move on your part. He's got a purple shield, so we're going to red button him. So he can't shoot me while the shield's on. And now, we've had enough of you. We've had enough of you. There's another robot. All right, we're going to hit that double damage and womp on his face as well. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Now, I just try to make sure I stay away from, you know, like, I've always got something to protect me. You know, I got cover to the left, cover to the right. As long as somebody's not over here or behind me right now, I'm in a really good spot to stay alive. So we're going to go ahead and go after whatever this is way in the back. Um, we got four beacons. We don't really need to push for another beacon. 
so yeah we won sweet that was a good game all right guys hopefully you enjoyed this video hope this helps as far as like understanding how to build and play your sharenga the sharenga is really cool he's a lot of fun even at kind of like a lower level as long as you got the right weapons on him he can do really well as you can see mine still needs some work right my sharenga still needs some work oh man hades over here nine kills he tore it up he tore it up i only had one beacon man that's it sometimes i think that the beacon counter doesn't always work maybe i really only had one i don't know but i thought i got a few either way please like and subscribe hit that little bell set those notifications to all all right that way you don't miss any cool uploads or you know i have a lot of giveaways often and stuff and you that way you don't miss those or you don't miss the announcement of the winners or you don't miss any news or fun builds or anything like that so yep like subscribe click that little bell and we will catch you next time all right see ya lightning out